I'm 69 years old, and my walk with God is quite, quite a long one. It all started back uh, when I was six. My mother uh, was a Christian. She believed in us going to Sunday school. So I started Sunday school at age six. I went through the years. I, I heard about God, uh, studied. We had classes. I, I studied, uh, you know, hearing about Noah and, and Daniel and all that. And for a number of years, uh, when I got into my teen years, I was in a, a, a youth choir at, at church. And then I felt a calling that I should go to Bible school. So I went to Bible school, went out to Saskatoon. Uh, that's where the Bible school was. And uh, I, I hadn't heard anything about the Holy Spirit. We were praying for a fella in the dorms. And uh, I could only go so far in English, so I went back to my room. And then all of a sudden I, I was able to uh, speak in tongues and I went back and, and uh, prayed for him and he was able to get tongues. Uh, at the same time, I, I met my, my wife. Uh, we, we got married out there, and then I moved back. Uh, I had a job here, bought a house, raised a family. And uh, because of the Holy Spirit in my, my life, I found I was much more closer to God. And I became quite involved in church. I was on boards and such. Uh, but then around uh, 50 or whatever, I, I lost my job and also my father died, all in the same time, time frame. So that sort of put me back a bit, and I started to kind of drift, uh, drift away f uh, a bit. And going from job to job, it started me in sort of a, a bit of a de depression. And I thought, well, maybe, maybe I should go move to another city. So we decided to move to Kelowna. But when I got to Kelowna, it was good at first, but then I fell into a really deep, severe depression. And I just wasn't myself, and I, I thought I, well, I'd go to the senior pastor, I thought I'd go to my family and different ones, but they just weren't hearing me. I went to the doctor, I even got a prescription, but I, I knew God was going to come through. I just knew it. And it started to affect my health. I wasn't able to sleep, and I would go to the bathroom properly. And I, I knew if God didn't step in, that I was headed for the loony bin. So then, uh, around Christmas time, close to Christmas, I went to bed, and you know how you, uh, you, if you have the flu and it lifts? Well, I felt the same thing when I woke up in the morning, my depression was gone. And oh, I was so happy. And then, from then on, I, I, I this I was about 10 years ago now, I, I start my day, I say, Lord, thank you. Thank you for that depression. And Lord, I can't do my day without you. And Thank you again for the healing.